Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're going to take a look at the hottest Galaxy Note 2 case that I've seen yet. Alright, this is by far the sickest case that I've seen for the Galaxy Note 2 on the market. But, before we get into that, let me just address something really, really quick. Now, shout out to everybody who's seen my hottest iPhone 5 case video. That was for this, the knuckle case. Look, let me just explain something to y'all real quick. When I say the hottest case that I've seen, that's just my personal opinion. That doesn't mean that it's written down somewhere. You know, you can't Google it. It's not a fact. It's just my personal opinion because this is my video on my channel. So I'm giving y'all my opinion. Let me, just, let me just throw this out there real quick. If you don't like the case, then you don't like it, then don't buy it. You know what I'm saying? It's that simple. If you don't like it, then don't buy it. If you don't like me and you don't like the video and all that, real simple. All you got to do is dislike the video and then keep it moving. All right? It's a lot of drama that's going on. It, it, look, if you want to see for yourself, look at my hottest iPhone 5 case video, the knuckle case, and read the comments. It's a lot of drama and bullshit going on, and I'm just trying to address this real quick because I'm not going to be responding to all of these uh, haters and trolls and all these racists out there and all that. We're not doing that this go around. All right? If you don't like the case, don't buy it. Point blank. And, and also, you know, there's a saying that we got in the hood. It, you know, it goes like this. Don't watch niggas' pockets. All right? That's the saying in the hood. Stop watching niggas' pockets. That's how they say it in the hood. And what that means is, look, if you read the comments, a lot of people are going to say, oh, that case is a waste of money. Uh, why you bought that? That's a waste of money. How is it a waste of money if you didn't spend a dime for it? You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't worry about what I'm spending my money on, you know, because it's my money. The same way, you know, you walk through the streets, you see somebody wear a pair of $250 Jordans on that, you know, it's the same Jordans that come out every year that have been coming out for the last 20 years. You can't walk up to that man and say, yo, that's a waste of money while you got them Jordans. You can't do that because if that man is a sneakerhead, then there's no price he ain't willing to spend for them sneakers. And that's the same thing, you know, when it, that it comes to me when, you know, when it's, when it's involved in tech shit, there's no price that I ain't going to pay for something that I want. If I want it, I'm going to get it. So I just had to address that really quick. Like I said, if you don't like the case, you don't like the video, just dislike it and then keep it moving. That's it. Nobody got time for all the bullshit comments. Now, with that said, let's pop this open now. Like I said earlier, this case is definitely sick. So I got the package in the mail straight from Hong Kong. Let's see what it is. Now, while I'm opening this up, let me ask y'all a question real quick. For all my dudes who's rocking the Galaxy Note... What's your main problem with it? What's the main thing that you wish you could change about the Galaxy Note? And it's real simple. Everybody going to have the same answer. The build quality. That's the main thing that, you know, that we gripe about on the Galaxy Note 2 is the build. Everything, on, everything else on the phone is sick. Except for the build, that plastic material. We all wish we could have kind of, you know, kind of have that iPhone material. But... Shout out to CaseFanatic.com. Now, look, I, I was going to, you know, normally I show the website and all of that, but right now their website is doing some maintenance, so I can't show y'all the website, but um, I'll leave it in the description. Shout out to Case Fanatics. They came up with the solution. All right, so this is what it looks like when you get it in the mail. It's going to be wrapped up in plastic and all of that. Now, I'm going to do a live installation on this. I watched the video of somebody install it. Looks pretty simple. So, whatever. We're going to do unedited. it live installation y'all ready for this yeah y'all ain't ready yet let me put this y'all ain't ready yet all right fuck it i'm ready let's go this is it the aluminum case for the galaxy note 2 now this is a screwdriver and it comes with screws all right, so you're going to screw this case on so it's going to be officially in there. Looks like you get a screen protector also. Bingo. Now, not the, you know, not the most fanciest one, but this case is called the Hunter. All right, the Hunter F. So if you go on um, casefanatic.com, let me, just, let me just throw this out there real quick too, while y'all just, you know, while y'all staring at this case, because trust me, this, this, this is sick. This is sick. But go on casefanatic.com. That site has thousands of cases. That's, that's probably one of the, the biggest case sites that I came across yet. They got cases for all of the phones and tablets. They got a special section for all ladies' cases. They got a special section for all metal cases. 
And if you want to get the Hunter, it comes in a bunch of colors. I wish I could have shown you all the site, but go look at it for yourself. It comes in blue. It comes in red. It comes in black, which, you know, the black one looks tough. Um, it comes in a uh, black and white kind of material together. A bunch of colors. And the hottest color to me, I think, is the solid aluminum one, especially if you have a white Galaxy Note. So let's take the back of this off and install this real quick. Now, if you look at the case, let's look around it real quick. You can see it has the buttons on the outside. You know, they have that little foam on the inside. But the buttons on the outside are very reminiscent of your iPhone. Okay, you got the spot for your headphones. Power. You can still get your stylus out of there. You can still plug your micro USB charger in there. On the back of the case, it has the cutout for the camera and all that. So once you put the case on and screw it in, you ain't going to have to take it back off. Nice little branding in the back. Hunter F, Samsung, Galaxy Note 2. Not too much fancy colors and stuff all over it. Nice, solid, aluminum-looking case. So let's figure this out. Now, it's a two-part two part jump off. Now, keep in mind, you're not, you're not going to need your battery cover anymore for your Galaxy Note 2. You know, take it and save it to the side. One thing I will mention about this case, though, and this is the downfall, there's no NFC. Even though half of y'all dudes, you know, don't use NFC, me, I only use NFC when I'm really trying to floss on somebody. Like when I got somebody in my office, you know, and they're trying to get cute, I got to pull out my Samsung tech tiles and shut them down, James Bond style. You know, whatever. I don't really use NFC, especially since Google Wallet is all fucked up right now. You know, everybody's Google Wallet is, is pretty much dead. So NFC ain't really popping right now the way it's supposed to be popping unless you're rocking the Samsung tech tiles, but whatever. If you want to sacrifice the NFC for having this badass case, then trust me, I think it's worth it. So let's see how it goes now. Okay, so all we're going to do is put the back on and put the front on. That's it. Real simple. And we're going to screw it in. Now, it comes with screws. Let me see. Maybe I'll just screw it on real quick. Let's just see how difficult this really is. Now, one thing I can tell y'all, these screws are tiny. Look at those screws. So let me see if I could do this. Now, I was at the Knicks game earlier. I had a couple of drinks, so <laughs> if I can't do this right now, then I have to do it later. But uh, let's see. All right, here we go. Okay, you just get the screw. This is so small, you might not even see that on camera. I just put the screw right in there. And now we're going to try to screw it right in this spot. Now, i got to pull the camera back for a minute so I can reach this. And, of course, I did that wrong. All right, well, look. I'm not going to do the screws and stuff on camera right now because I'm a little bit buzzed. <laughs> but the case is still on there. We're going to get it tight and all that. But you can see exactly what it looks like let's see if the buttons and everything work oh, I just took the battery off of this one earlier so I got to plow this back on all right so the button works look at this this is definitely definitely sick all right this is a major go right here it's a solid aluminum the, the, the phone doesn't feel too heavy but it feels like if I'm holding a big giant iPhone with that nice aluminum, you know, metal kind of feel. This is sick. Now, I ordered this. One thing I will say also, if you're going to order this, it's coming from Hong Kong. All right. Now, I ordered this. I'm going to keep it real with y'all. Today is April 24th. I ordered this on March 28th. So, it took almost about a month to get here. But, you know, going through customs and all that stuff, you know, when you order stuff from Hong Kong, it's going to take a minute. So, um, you know, be patient. Keep in mind, they come in, they, you know, they have it out already for the S3. So, I ordered, once I ordered the one for the Note 2, I ordered one for the S3 maybe about a week later. So, I should be getting that one maybe next week. But um, I, can't, I can't stress the feeling of this case. You know, you've seen it in pictures, you know, most of y'all, some of y'all seen it already, you know, like, like, this ain't brand new, but, um, you can't get the actual feel of it from looking at the pictures, and this is just sick. This is how the Galaxy Note should have came from day one, but whatever, I guess it would have been, you know, they would have had to probably charge a little bit more for it, 
but this case will run you $60 and it's worth every penny. Every penny. Now look, when I did the iPhone 5, the knuckle case, this case cost $120. Yeah, it doesn't provide any protection for the phone and all of that, but this is just a conversation starter. This is just a, you know, an eye catcher. And look, y'all might think I'm exaggerating, but every single place I go, when I pull out this, when I pull out this knuckle case, somebody want to see it, somebody want to hold it, or somebody's like, yo, that's hot. They want to buy it right out of my pocket. This case is, is a go. And this is, you know, it's aluminum. Whatever. But it's not that practical. You know, if you drop the phone, as you can see, I dropped it right here. It got little scratches on it. If you drop it, it's not going to protect the phone and all that. So it's not that practical. It costs $120. So, yeah, you know, it might be, you know, over the top for some people. But, you know, like I said, ask a sneakerhead is $250 over the top for some Jordans. And they're going to look at you like you got two heads. You feel me? So this is not over the top for me. But for the Hunter case now, keep in mind that this one is $60. Now, if you drop your phone, this is all aluminum. So if you drop your phone, now, I didn't put the screen protector on because this is one of those flimsy screen protectors. So, you know, I tend to stay away from these. And let me show you why. If you look at my HTC One, you see, you can see all those little scratches and how, you know, how it look all beat up. I just put the screen protector on like two days ago. All right, so these little cheesy free ones that come with a case, yeah, I'll put them on if I don't have nothing else, you know, whatever, but... I'm not gonna ruin the 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 nice build of this phone now. And y'all see, I got the the um from Speedgen.com. I got the aluminum home button, so now it just looks even more sick. Y'all see, I be rocking Facebook home lately. Get out of there. This is sick. On a scale of one to ten, this is a go. I, when I say that now, there's no number. That means that you can't put a number on this. This is a win right here. When I pull this, I can't wait to see when I, because I'm going out of town tomorrow. I want to see the reaction when I pull this out and everybody else got their, you know, their, all the rubber cases and all that. I want to see if people even realize that this is a Galaxy Note or if they think it's some kind of hybrid iPhone, iPhone 6 and a half or whatever. But um, this is a go right here. This is a, this is a definite go. So I'm going to put the screws on. When I cut the camera, so I could really, you know, really kind of focus. Because like I said, I was watching the Knicks game with my number 33, Patrick Ewing jersey on. While the Knicks was dropping bombs on the, on the Celtics. I was getting busy. You know what I mean? But this case, I'm shaking my head. Y'all can't see me, but this is definitely sick. Casefanatic.com, $60 to get you heavy in the game. Put you right on top of the food chain. I'm going to post this pitch up on Instagram and, and let the party start in a few minutes. Let all my, all, all, all my real tech heads, y'all going to appreciate this. All y'all haters and all that, y'all probably won't get this and all that. Well, y'all might think it's a waste of money and all that. Whatever, do y'all. But me and the homies who rock out, we all going to be rocking these and we're going to be looking crazy right now. This is sick. Like I said, all the different colors and all that. But I, personally, I think if you got a white one, the silver looks dope and you get the you know, silver home button. This is a go right here. This is a major go. All right. Shout out to everybody that rocked me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Like I said before, I'm about when I get back from out of town, I'm dropping the stickers up there. So anybody who want to rock the, you know, the stickers, you know, let everybody know that your phone is officially floor certified. I'm going to add a link to get them stickers up. We do that in a minute. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where we're doing it big. We're having mad fun. We're on there full throttle, 24-7 vampire life. You know what I mean? It's your boy Floss. I'm going to catch up with y'all on the next trip. And as usual, haters eat a dick. I'm out. Before I go, just look Just look at this one more time. Just, just look at this. You got to feel this in order to really to get the full effect, but I'm winning right now. I'm definitely winning. I'm out of here.